Let's first define what is known as a system and then also talk about surroundings. So equilibrium thermodynamics deals with systems which may or may not be in contact with surroundings. So let's first define a system. This real big box here, this will re represent the universe. That's that. And then what we do within the um, uh, universe here, we carve out part of the universe and we'll define this thing as the system. And the part of the universe that is not part of the system we'll call the surroundings. So equilibrium thermodynamics deals with energy flows between the system and surroundings. Energy can be transferred to and from the system and surroundings and also it has to do with the energy just of the system itself. So thermodynamics energy going from one place to another or within the system what the energy of that system is. So thermodynamics deals with that. Um, equilibrium thermodynamics deals with systems that are at equilibrium. We'll define more precisely later on in the course exactly what we mean by equilibrium. Non-equilibrium thermodynamics as you might expect has to do with actually energy flows going from one place to another. So thermodynamics is the energy of a system at equilibrium and more generally it's the energy uh, of a system at some initial state and the energy change at some final state and these two states that we're looking at the energy changes are equilibrium at equilibrium. So it really doesn't say how a system goes from one equilibrium state to another but it does tell what the energy difference is between those two states non-equilibrium thermodynamics will give more precise specification of exactly how things happen going from one state to another. 